Good morning. Still very excited about the last days. So next up, the city of jazz, soul, big old New Orleans. Oh, big easy. How it's lovely, charming, easy going, laid back, nice citizens, the Louisianans call it. What a great city, a city of contrast. A city with lots of beautiful places, a city with history, a city which has seen uh, good times and bad times, such as uh, Katrina, for instance, um, back in uh, 2006 and some places have still not yet fully recovered and I speak to an Uber driver who has lost more or less everything but uh, still struggling and uh, still going going forward so it's a really cool place a bit noisy here so I'm really looking forward to the next days here So they say New Orleans has one of the highest crime rates in the US. Really not so bad after all. Although I'm in a pretty fine cafe, I have to use this to eat my quiche. I mean, really? I'm looking forward to seeing the French Quarter by night. So hey, that's my new friend Benji. He's a filmmaker. Yeah, that's me. Living in New Orleans. We met yesterday. Nice lens. Thank you, man. Tell, tell us a little bit about you. Um, what are you doing? Uh, well, I'm out filming right now. In fact, that's when you met me. That's what I was doing. And uh, what I was doing, I was filming the. Uh, pickup shots for my documentary which is coming out which cool. is about a shoe that was popular in New Orleans uh, in the 90s uh, it's a Swiss shoe it's right? a Swiss shoe yeah so it's from Europe but it was very popular here in the city and so you know it'll be done soon so right now I did all, all my interviews right now what I'm doing is all the b-roll and the scenes and everything cool. that explains the story visually we ain't talk about when bus down say put your ballads on <laughs> The way it looks, the, the quality of it. So if you was gonna be crispy in his footwork, you gotta have the shirt work too. If not, you was out of work. Cutlers is with dates and bows and caprices and all that. And what do you love about New Orleans? Ha! Ah, the free spirit of it. 
you know, I love uh, I love the rain. The rain is great. Uh, I love the culture. The culture is great. Uh, the people, you know, the people are friendly. And uh, I mean, I've lived in a lot of different places. Uh, and it's very different. I didn't know, but it's very different in other places, you know. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I mean, that's that's the, the gist of it, you know, I guess you could call it. Uh, I love that, like, I can go and shoot this documentary here because everybody's open to talking. Everybody's open to discussing. Like, you can stop anybody on the street if they're yeah. from here and have a, a very long yeah. conversation with them. As you know, you met me. Yeah, so, sure. You know, yeah. Well, so, we, we met the other ones well, yesterday. Yes, right. The one guy who was carrying a weapon with him, right? Yes, that's right. Yeah, yeah <laughs> he had the gun. <laughs> Which still kind of creeps me out in America, but yeah. well. It's uh, a lot of guns, but it's okay. It's okay. It's that okay. if you're watching, I'm I'm totally safe, really. <laughs> it's all love. It's all love here. Everybody remember that. It's all love in New Orleans. Yeah, but, but what you said about the spirit is, is really right, yeah? Because mm -hmm. um, uh, I felt that uh, also uh, the people are very warm-hearted, open, and, and it's a really cool place. Yeah, awesome. I'm glad you like it. NOLA 300. What about that? Uh, tricentennial of New Orleans. Uh, it started in 1718. That's when it was founded, and uh, here we are. We're celebrating it 300 years later. Cool. Yeah, just some numbers for you if you like numbers. That's cool. I, yeah. I love numbers. I'm yeah. very talented with numbers. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> of course, I'm not. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I was an idiot in school. In yeah. So I gotta cut that out now. Yeah. Well, you can keep it. No, I'm gonna cut it out. Okay. <laughs> We are right now in the French uh, Quarter. French Quarter, right? Right, right. Um, and, and it's called French Quarter because because of the French, clearly. right? Uh, they uh, maintained occupancy uh, before they sold it, you know, to the U.S. Uh, and which is also why I think New Orleans is one of the oldest cities in the nation because the French were here, you know, early, uh, you know, putting it together. And uh, what I was telling you about Armstrong Park was is that Armstrong Park uh, is also called Congo Square, yeah. which is where the French would allow their slaves to go and drum and practice their religion on the on Sundays. The culture, the, the culture is very strong here as far as like, uh, as it relates to Africa, mm -hmm. you know, it's very strong here. There's, uh, there is, uh, <laughs> it's going down. There's a, there's a lot of uh, drug retention in the city uh no so 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 there are a lot of there's a lot of cultural retention that's happened here in the city in new orleans and it's what makes it so rich here you know um that was nice yeah. uh and uh you know what, what what makes it so rich is because the cultures have uh, just maintained a lot of what they originally had mm -hmm. and so you know with the with the french you have uh you have a lot of the flavor you know, uh, you have some of the architecture. You know, there's also a lot of Spanish architecture because the Spanish was here. Uh, we have a lot of cultural, uh, you know, culture from the, the, the Africans who were here. Uh, the food, you know, that's that's all. But all of it's mixed in together. It's all like this gumbo. Yeah. You know, it all come exactly. together. Uh, and so then you got the Acadians who came down from Canada. They're French. Okay. Right. So you sure. got their culture down here, you know, cool. mixed in. and. And uh, and yeah, I mean that's 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 what makes New Orleans unique and yeah. beautiful. It looks a bit European to me sometimes. Here, yeah. this place, yes, yeah, yeah. it's very, yeah. very, yeah. I mean, as you where, said, I mean, that's where our style comes from. Th that's where it comes from. Yeah. That's why when people from the states come here, they're always amazed because of Little Europe. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. You know, and and not just the, not just the design, but I think the attitude. You know. Cool. Um, What's happening, man? Huh? Preacher deal. Preacher? Preacher show. Oh no! No, no thanks. No, no, I saw that. Uh, they were, that's what they're talking about. No, Preacher Three. That's what they're filming right now. Yeah, dude. Man. I'm filming that shit here in the Orleans. What y'all out here doing? Just shooting his travel yeah. vlog. Doing a little bit of, you know, oh. shooting. Yeah, stuff leave my like face that. out of. Huh? Huh? Leave my face out of. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure, 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 man. We got yeah. you. A lot of gangsters in New Orleans. He, he didn't look like a gangster. No? No. No? He's not. <laughs>
he, he wasn't stereotyping. I was not you, stereotyping. So should him. should you um, in the beautiful suit watch? Then but when he said know, to me, "Don't put my face in this video," he gave away. That was the clue. He was a gangster, <laughs> or he does some gangster things. Ah, uh, Benji, do you know what? Hey, I think I forgot to s to stop the recording. Okay, so it's on. Okay. When he was. Run! So just getting out of the bar, bartender yeah. Andrew Rodriguez, bartender of New Orleans in 2016. Shout out to you. So the United States of America are known for their draconic policies on alcohol in public streets. Not so in the Big Easy. Perfectly allowed here. I like this city. It's a cool laid back city, nice people. Um, it's really difficult to not get in touch with somebody. You, you're holding a camera, you're doing, I don't know, you're filming a little bit, doing, taking pictures. Oh, Do you want to be in the vlog? Sure. <laughs> hey. Why not? hey. You're on the vlog. Yes, good. Welcome to New Orleans. Hey. Well, hey, Cheers. At the New Orleans. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers mates. Cheers. Welcome. Thank you. And the people just walk up to you. And you know, it's it's you make friends all the time, um, just as as Benji holding that camera right now. So it's really cool. I love it. Break bread. <laughs> break bread. Make friends. Break bread. That's it. That's it. Like they do in Greece. Benji, time to say goodbye now. All right. You goodbye. gotta, you gotta now. get home and do some, do some Editor. work. Bye, my friend. Thank you, man. You're always invited to Austria, right? Yes. Yeah. Thank you. I'll be there. been such a great time here in New Orleans. I'm really gonna miss this city. So many smiling faces from rich to poor. Everybody has a good nice word for you. And I'm really gonna miss the people here. But how is it in life? All endings are beginnings. This one's for you, Christoph. Back at the airport. Security check, boarding to Houston. If you liked the episode, subscribe, like, and share. And as always, thanks for watching. They know how hard they was hitting in New Orleans. New Orleans. New Orleans. New Orleans. New Orleans.